Hello everyone and welcome back to Xmorph Defense. Franz here as always and well today we're heading to the US of E. Not China as the game decided to make us think. Uh, China's way down there so it goes Egypt, China, Japan. We've also got Hawaii, Mexico and Nigeria in here. Okay so the US E. There are the lot of ground units. Holy crap. No boss but oh my god the tanks. Holy crap. Uh, it looks like one of them has a shield there from what I'm seeing. So let us get in here and see what happens. Now we do have two technologies that we can now have access to, so we might want to actually get some lasers. It is recommended to add the lasers. Well, we'll have some lasers. We don't have any technologies that we can actually take with us just now. The, the, I didn't know if that was firing or not. I don't know if it was just me. Faster ghost speed, uh, defense beams. The passive upgrade protects the X-Morph ship automatically. It fires energy beams that disintegrate incoming projectiles. I might switch that to that. Seems like a better one. This is nearly all upgraded. We've only got the two left there, and then we've got that as these two. As basically, you can turn the towers into either laser or missiles, which will probably be more powerful, because obviously, you can see there, the rate of fire is far higher, the range is far higher. Still uses the same power, though. The rate of fire in them is much lower, but the power level is pretty much, like, maxed out. So, let us begin in the US of E and see if we don't die. I know about the hit. During the intermission phase, holographic tags are displayed at the edges of the screen and are attached to enemy paths. They show which types of units are going to come and beat you up. In the next phase of planetary assimilation, this area is populated by another aggressive tribe called Americans. Human another aggressive tribe called the, the Americans? Oh my god, this game. Our cores and actively supporting other human tribes. Our simulations concluded that in order to minimize the cost of defending our cores, we should establish a base in this area. This will put their actions into chaos and make our tasks easier in other parts of the planet. Just as we expected, the Exmorph have finally landed in the USA. After the defeat near the Caspian Sea, the Russians tried to destroy the Exmorph base with a nuclear strike. But the aliens neutralized all of their warheads. Direct assault is the only way to fight them. I'm sending in scout units to assess this landing site. Jet fighters in the zone, attacking the aliens. Don't think I don't see you over there. Can I break this? Is it possible to break a crane in the path? Where, where are you? Into the water you go. Splish splash. Oh, there's more of you. Alright. Alrighty. Oh my complete. god, there's so many ways. We've got a clear approach to the Exmorph core from multiple directions. I'm sending in regular ground forces. Now if I send them that way, like if I did this here, what's that gonna do to them? Send them through the building? Alright, that's Noted. Um, hmm, right, so that's a very, very short bit there. Which is not good. I mean, you could potentially... Can we do this? Is it possible? Let's move that... Let's move that to there just now. I'll move that to there. I'm curious of something. You can... Because you can force them to essentially go around the core to get into the core, which is quite nice. What I'm going to do is also get rid of this though and rid of this. And I'm going to set that to be a laser. So we can actually see what the laser looks like. And we have enemies coming this way. Uh, okay. Um... Now, do we want it down here so they go around there, or do we want it there so they go over there? Actually, there's no way for them to go over there. Right, so here it goes. Up! Timber! Or not. Get your butt down! Don't fall too far to the right! Oh my... oops. Well, that's that bit now fixed. Uh, this way looks like it's just a direct up, and um, we probably want to try and force these guys to kind of go this way altogether. 
And maybe across this bridge, if possible. These guys, it's going to be... Oh, is there any way to maybe put them around there or something? I could do. Put them around there and then I'm going to come up to here. A little bit of a longer area. Um, oh, wait. They've got... That's jump pack dudes. I don't want jump pack dudes. Where is it? This all kind of merges into one, which is okay. Uh, now, there was another one of the big structures somewhere that I could break down somewhere. No? Hmm. Right, so what I want to do is I want to put that there. And then another one here. Because then it's going to force them to go that way, which is good. That gives it a little bit more time. Um, now, we do want them to then go that way, if at all possible. I think the only way we're going to make this work is if we take one of them away. Did we put any other ones anywhere? No. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to revert that back just now. And I'm going to put that one... Ah, uh, wait a minute. If we get rid of that... And then if we put that... Hmm. What if we do this? To this. Oh, no, they need to go that way, actually. Uh, right. If we... Hmm. We do need you going that way. So it's going to take them longer to get around, but I think what we could do... What if we then... No. Because we want them to come down and around like this. Just, you know have to go that way, although we could probably put them down there. I mean, if we put that to there, to there, I mean, they're going to have to go all the way around there to get up to here. I think. Yes. But we can't do that right now. Although, do they have... They don't have much in the way of range on these guys, which is slightly worrying me. That one I'm going to move down to there. Oh, never mind then. Nothing's impossible when you put your mind to it. So that's going to go up there. That'd be a good place for an actual artillery unit. I don't know what to do with this. Because if we take that away then they're going to scoot right up there. I mean, how many do we have coming this way? Not particularly many are coming this way, but... We don't want to leave anything to chance. We have a lot of units going to be piling down here. It, to be honest, they're jumpers. They can actually just jump over what we have. But really, ideally, I would want to put that there to there. So it'd send them all the way around, all the way up here to get to this bit. Again, passing the same turret. So let's begin. Ready to begin mission. Why are they suddenly going that way? You're not meant to be. Get out of. Air support ready. We've got your back. Over. Don't know if this idea is working. Ow. Okay. Not good. Not good. Spawn. Core's okay. Core's okay. Core's okay. Alrighty. It's a massacre. The aliens have already built strong fortifications. I'm sending in tanks with strong infantry support. Yeah, let's see. 
That is coming already from that way. So we're going to do that, and then we're going to do that, and then we're going to connect them to there. We're also going to make this. Ooh. We'll make that that. And we'll make that one of these guys. We'll then connect this to here. Because we want to make them go all the way around. <laughs> it's just like, yep, you're going to go all the way around here. And that one can be a laser as well. Alrighty, so we're going to get to see some laser action. And that's going to put them that way, so it's going to, they're all going to be coming down this way. So, I mean, that's got a lot there. So, I mean, that's a lot to handle that bit. This is going to be probably the main bit, because that's got 60 of them. We need a flamethrower. I mean, these guys here are good for what it is. They're sending that up that way, which is good. They're coming all the way around there. Right, let's begin. Engaging hostiles. Alrighty, who's first? You over here. Hey guys, how you doing? Bye bye. I'll be taking that off you, don't worry about me. Thank you, thank you very kind. Alright, these guys are gonna oh wait. Why the tanks just decide to make their own route? I suppose they can, but that's unfair. Oh my. A laser is ver. Oh wow! Holy crap! Jet fighters in the zone, attacking the aliens. That's the wrong one. Which one? That one. Let's take all that. Thank you. Did one get in? No, it didn't. Curious if taking out those bridges will do anything. Oh god, they got over. Wrong thing. I need this. Attacking the alien. Ow. I'm dead. Alright. Noted. Could you butt in? So apparently we're going to need some sort of flamer up here. I don't know if I... Jet fighters ETA, three seconds. Oh, wait, that's used as... Oh, dear. That wouldn't be good to take that out then. Don't you run away from me. I need your spare parts. Are too weak to Holy crap, through. what is that thing? I'm sending in advanced tanks with plasma shields. Oh, hey. Warning. New enemy units incoming. Yeah, Their the shields are very resilient to the plasma weapons that are used in our towers in your fighter. We recommend using other weapons against these units. Like this? 
Oh, that doesn't even... Oh, what? You serious? Well, that worked. The rocket to the face seems to work, you know? The plasma shields are working. Prepare a coordinated strike, including more shielded tanks and additional support units. Oh, boy. Um. Okay, let's go that way. Make you a flamer. I'm gonna force you guys that way. Gonna make you laser. Just gonna put that that way. That's a flavor. Although all the guys are gonna come in that way. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I mean, we could actually connect that to there, so they. Oh, they will go past the flamer. Okay. We don't have any anti-air. That's gonna be a little bit of a problem. Now, what we could do is resort that back to normal. No, because it does have a lot of range from that. Okay, let's just do that. And we'll put that there. I do need to make it though. Let's uh, make you just normal for the time being. Make you anti. Yeah. Alright, so. We don't have anything just shooting up from here this time. They're coming all from this way. We've got Flamer there. Uh, they're coming on from, like, yeah, this is basically the one big chain going on here. Where is this? This is just this big chain. Okay, let's begin. Tanks on the way. Ready to fight in a few seconds. Assault helicopters ready. On course to alien base. Come on. Pop out. Oh, you're at the other side. Lantier unit is doing pretty damn incredibly well. Bye bye. All right. Uh. Well, these things do not die easy at all. Oh crap. Um, let's upgrade you, but, you know what, dissolute lasers, I think we're going to need it. Air support coming up in a minute. They're doing damage to them, just not enough quickly. Awesome. Right at that, damn it. That did not work. Uh, wonder if we can. About to get in. Nope. Oh man. I just realized this wave is not even over yet. Suppose you're technically just heating up the tank when you're using a laser. Because it's not plasma, it's a laser. So. Eh. Now what? I'm over here, guys. Hello? 
And more I'm sending in more advanced tanks. What do you mean you've almost broken through? You haven't got near the core in the last three rounds. Hey, where is this here? This is going to need to go here. And we'll take that there. Should be enough for that. Right, so we have these guys all running down this way. We have these over here. These are actually pretty much useless. Why are they over there? And what I want to do is I want to do that there, and I want to put that there. And connect that. So it makes them go around. And... Ah. There's no way to kind of push them that way, is there? Probably better just, you know, putting something here and something here and connecting them up. And we'll put a... Don't tell me things are impossible. I'll make it possible. The laser there. So that's going to go that way. They're going to all come around that way and then up here, which is good. We have some units going to be a bit of a pest. I mean, if we could get that to be a flamer. Uh, let's uh, make that there. And we will then convert that into flamer. Alright, begin. This first. One click away from alien base. That way. Hey guys, how you doing? You wanna come play? I'm gonna dump a crane on your head, by the way. Or oh. that actually does fall. That's so completely the wrong one I wanted to be. I think there's enough explosions going on? Holy crap! Switch! I mean, you could switch the ones on the fly, actually. Uh, okay, so we need one... What? Intercepted to acquire additional resources. Battle zone has been expanded. What? That's not going to help us at all. He's under attack. From what, though? Oh. Oh, okay. Switch. Switch. Oh, okay. A little bit much in the way of everything. Out of here. I should have kept my mouth shut during that little uh, calm before the storm because they got through. Yeah. Where do these guys go? What if I. Is there anybody sent. No, because. Send them that way. Gun 
Starship Ops team, ready to begin mission. You go away. Shoot. No. Scram. Go away. I don't want you. Go away. Go away. You as well. Go away. Shoo! <laughs> we can't let the Exmorp Ooh. establish a base in the USA. Prepare the artillery and air transports. We won't let this go so easily. Really? We are attacking fiercely. Prepare for a strong attack. I never would have guessed game, you know? Let's get rid of you and take you and take you. Where's the other one landed? There, of all places. Alright then. Let's switch that to anti air. Put that there and put that there. Make that up and make that anti air. Flamer, normal. The tanks are coming down here. Ugh. <laughs> Should have guessed. Uh, let's make that a laser. That's anti air. Laser. Flamer. Probably doesn't need to be a flamer anymore, but it could switch to being artillery. That's a laser. Okay. Alrighty, uh, this might not go well. Transport on site. Preparing delivery. Stand by for deployment. I'm gonna go over here and help him. Mobile artillery team ready to enter mission zone. How many things are you gonna send? What? Oh god. Switch! Switch to that! Oh wow. I wasn't expecting that there. Ow. I'm getting to it, I'm getting to it, don't worry. Should probably be changed for that as well. Oh my good god. How about you go away? How about you leave? Leave. Leave now. One. How are you under attack? Jet fighters in the zone, attacking the aliens. <laughs> well then, that uh, got pretty pure, sir. Come on, go away. There we go. Alrighty, let's uh, gather up all this goodies here. There we go. Get that and that. Gunship Opsi, ready to begin mission. No. Hi. You miss me? Why is it so red? Oh my... What? That's impossible! After all that we've sent there, the alien base is still standing! Prepare for the final strike! Uh, what We're the hell is this? We're sending in heavy tanks from the north and grasshoppers from the south! The hell is... Humans are becoming desperate! Uh. Watch out for the new units that they just sent against us! 
Oh god. Okay. Uh, right, why are you able to go around that? And there we go. Right. Um, what? Oh, seriously? Are you actually kidding me? <sighs> Let's see. How is that over there? That's still there. Nah, that's probably no point. Um, put that there. Yeah, we're just gonna do that. Usually that works. That's anti-air. So go with that there. We've got artillery units going to be coming from this direction. It's going to be a bit of a pain. Uh, no artillery coming from there. So let's take this away that it's down to a normal. I'm going to put this here to just do some damage to the mobile artillery. This one still seems to be damaged or something, which is confusing me. There's no artillery coming from there, there's nothing coming from there, the jumpers coming from there, and uh, nothing coming from there. So the only artillery it seems to be is over this way, I think. Yeah, it does seem to be it. Alright, let's begin. Grasshoppers on site. Heading direct to alien base. I didn't know. <laughs> just, just died, you know? Artillery ready. Stand by for heavy pounding. No, we have none of the heavy pounding, thank you. We need air support on station ASAP. That does seem to cut through them, but you're here. Go away. Holy crap! Um... Sure. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, man. I mean, we could put down some more turrets. Might be an advisable thing to bloody well do. We need air support. We need it now. Ow. Ow hurts a lot. Man, that just bounced right off of that. And I'm dead again. Well, that happened. Wow. And I'm dead again. Holy crap, could you stop killing me? Or is fine, kind of. One 
expecting that to be that one. Sheesh. Tidies up everything into a nice, careful little package. There we go. Give me all that. Thank you very much. There we go. And I'll take all that as well and all that. Excellent. Thank you. Is that all gone? We've been defeated. Good. This failure will cost us a lot of support from the Americans. But if the aliens think that we're going to give up, they are very wrong. After all, we were able to evacuate the plans and parts for Project Defender that can finally stop the aliens. Project Defender? Transport all commanding personnel to designated evacuation sites and await further orders. I say again, I am ordering a full retreat to our designated safe zones. Well then, that is USA done. Prepare the core to assimilate this region's resources. Reconfigure the geodetic matrix and initiate the expansion of this base's energy output potential. It looks like the humans are preparing some kind of desperate weapon of last resort. We have to track their communications. This could pose a threat to our harvesters. Move your consciousness to the next landing site. Alrighty guys, so that is the USA mission now complete, so thank you very much for joining us for this episode. It's been pretty damn spectacular, some of these missions are pretty difficult, but I'm really enjoying what I'm seeing. And we will see you in the next episode.